Hello friends and welcome to today's episode. My name is Lee, also known as Osiris. And in today's episode, we are gonna be showing you exactly how to get to the Crown Tundra. Now, I've had a few of you already asking me. The Crown Tundra has literally just dropped, uh, just updated. Uh, so I'm putting this together for you guys to give you a bit of a helping hand. So once you're in the game, the first thing that you wanna be doing is getting the update for Sword and Shield. To do this, you wanna hit your home button on your menu, uh, on your controller, uh, come to this screen and then press the plus icon. This will then take you to the software update, the screen here. You can click uh, software update via the internet um, and then just click OK, go through the motions and it will check for available updates. And then it should come up with the current update. You just go ahead, download that. Once that is finished, you then come back into the game and you want to be heading to Wedgehurst Station. So the same place that we went to for the Isle of Armour, um, which is a right down here on the map, we were there. And normally when you do this though, the update will come into effect when you restart the game and a message will pop up saying that you've got the crown pass and it will say you need to go to Wedgehurst Station. But in case you miss any of those details, this is gonna be here for you to, uh, to guide you through. So just come over to this NPC character here. Where would you like to go today? You'll give you the option of the, the Isle of Armour, Armour Station or Crown Tundra Station. So you just click Crown Tundra Station and you will come here. And once you're here, you're in Isle of Armour. This NPC character here will then speak to you once you come into the area for the first time. She will update your Pokedex and that is it. You are ready to go. You'll come out of the station. You'll have a nice cutscene and then the game will begin with Peony in the distance there. Um, so I hope this has been useful. Obviously it is Wedgehurst Station. None of the other stations will give you access to traveling to the Crown Tundra. A bit like the Isle of Armour, but I thought I'd just put this up here as early as possible to give as many of you a helping hand get into the Crown Tundra and enjoy it as soon as possible so thanks for tuning in friends do hit the like button do subscribe if you are new to the channel and i will see you all for another one very soon take care